Hello, welcome to Microsoft Dynamics 365 Financial Operation Tutorial Series. In this video, we will talk about that sometimes we create objects or elements in our project, but we want to organize it based on the element type. Or when we will try to create any object like class or any table, then it should create automatically folder for the related elements automatically uh, then you have to do a setup in visual studio then you don't have to take any pressure to create folder um, by right click on the project okay it will do your task automatically so how can we do that so first you have to create the project then you have to go to the extension and here you can see that dynamics 365 is there and below there is an option you can see here and you have to click that option and this particular window will open and after that you can see that project is there so you can see that this one is selected for me so organize project by element type so if you click this one so your folder creation will be automatically created so when click when you will create our class then uh, a class folder will be automatically created and if you create another class then that class will be added on that particular folder so also other than this you can see synchronized database on build for newly created project so if you want to synchronize your database on build for newly created project then you can select this particular option or checkbox here also other than this you can see always add a new project to existing solution so if you have a solution that you can see in this section that we have a solution and then we are trying to add a project inside the solution and if you want that if you will create a new project then under this solution uh, our project will be add then you have to select this particular option so I hope uh, you understood the concept how we can uh, use these three checkbox in our project so let me show this one so after that you have to select the ok button or you have to click the ok button and now if we create one element here like uh, like class here and at this point of time i will not give any name so I directly i will add and it will take some time to add the object so for that we have to wait now you can see that this classes folder automatically created and under this uh, classes folder the class is actually added so if we will again click on the project and if we will add one more class then that will be added on the same folder again so you can see that it is added again if we will create any new table so table folder will be automatically created okay so you have to select the data uh, models and then you have to add one particular table and you can see that table folder automatically added so this way each and every element for which you want to add in your project that will be in an organized form as well as if you'll uh, build the project the synchronization will be automatically set up you don't have to click on this synchronization button so if you have if you will set that particular checkbox then you can easily synchronize as well as build at the same same point of time so i hope now it's clear that how we can organize um, our elements easily in our project so thanks for watching this video see you in the next one till then take care bye bye